It's 6.30 in the morning and we're just making our way down to the bus. So we're going to a place called Plaza Las Perlas. And that is where we are being collected to be taken on our tour to Shauha. come through the gift shop and opened up into the park and the first thing we see is like a massive looks like a massive model of Tulum we've, we've just got to the park and it um, it's quite cloudy today and it seems to be like probably the coldest day we've had in weeks. So we're all here in t-shirts and shorts and uh, we're shivering. And I think the, the highest temperature it's going to be today is like 24, 25, which is, which is pretty low compared to what it's been. Regardless of the temperature, we're gonna have a great time anyway. Um, but I just thought it was funny. It's the coldest time it's been. <laughs> so we're actually the first people into the park. <laughs> Shell Ha is a natural water park. It's an all-inclusive day with food and drinks. It's a huge site, so there's loads of things to do. There are also additional activities that you can add on top. We started the day off with breakfast and then before hitting the water we wanted to check out the kids play area which was brilliant there was loads to do here there was kind of a splash pool area um, slides seesaws um, a massive rope area through the woods there were slides into the water the kids absolutely loved it <laughs> What are you say, Theo? Can't hear you, mate. <laughs> Snorkeling is one of the main attractions here. You get all the equipment, the mask, and flippers all included. We managed to go several times during the day and saw loads and loads of different variations of fish. So just pick myself up a nice uh, pina colada as we're walking around. And um, yeah, we're just about to go and do the zip line and do the jump as well. There's a big jump that you can do into the water. So we're gonna go and have a look at that next. There is a lot of walking to be done at the park, um, which is great, lots of exploring. It did take us about 25 minutes to walk to the top end of the park where we started our tubing to come back down the lazy river. There's lots of people zip lining in all different directions here. And then you've got people tubing uh, further down, which we're gonna do in a minute. So, That's it, Jazz. Wow, good job. It's us that's going to fall off. Well, make sure you push off, though. Okay, um, is it first time? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Okay, position. Keep your arms crossed, okay? No flips, no diving head. Okay. Just straight down, okay? Okay. You want to go first? I'll go first, yeah. yeah. Oh, Zara, you're going first. You don't have to go. Okay, sir. So one, two, three. After the jumps, we headed to the top to then go in the tubes all the way down the lazy river. Look 
So I'm currently just in a rubber ring, floating down the uh, lazy river. At... Hello! And with Jazzy. Hey! Hi, what's up, mate? <laughs> We're just floating through the mangroves, <laughs> and it's really cool. We're gonna get fished away, Daddy. <laughs> no, it's good, it's fine. <laughs> Look back at the mangroves. Oh, I don't know. Was it good? Yeah. So lots of people are coming down on the lazy river, people jumping in here from high, all the zip lines down there, it's amazing. Yeah. Good idea? Yeah. That was good. A really good selection of food. I had a bit of um, kabichi to start with, which is like um, fish with tomatoes um, and onion and cucumber, which is like fresh and cold, which is really nice. And then I had, um, it's almost like some pulled pork <clears throat> and some chicken and some rice. It's really nice, really tasty. So I got sausages, meatballs, um, tortillas, and I made my pudding. Um, I had fajitas, I had meatballs, a uh, little sausage, tortillas, and now I'm just on this <laughs> uh, I tried. I wanted to try loads of little things, so then I had a zoli, I think it was soup, which is like a traditional Mexican soup. Uh, and then I tried some beef barbacoa. Um, I tried some chicken, I think it was called pibil, uh, which was really nice. And I'm just looking down at my plate and seeing what I had. And then I tried some tamales, which was something different. So this is a tamale, and this is wrapped in a vine leaf. So I'm going to unwrap it and have a bite, and I'll tell you what it's like. So I'm not sure what it is, but it tasted sort of like a corn base on it, and it had like some sort of meat wrapped inside. Tasted okay. But I think that was it. Yeah, and it was really, really good. Really nice food. Yeah, there's, there's about three restaurants and there's quite a selection of different foods. So, um, and now I'm just about to sink down a um, mango margarita. Cheers. The lighthouse is a huge slide that goes round and round and round and Theo absolutely loved it. Hey, look at this. I've been that close before. Oh, look at this. Towards the end of the day, we ended up walking round and trying to get through the last few bits that we hadn't managed to see. There were caves, cenotes, um, and loads more things around the other side of the park, which we just hadn't managed to get to. I think they're really cool buses, aren't they? can't really fault the day at all. Um, everything was super on time, very well organised. I guess the only downside was that we didn't get around the whole thing, which was a bit of a shame. We rushed to get around some stuff at the end and then didn't make it back in time for the restaurants before they shut to get anything for dinner on the way home. Um, and just the weather let us down a little bit. Um, it would have been a lot better if the sun was out because we wouldn't have got cold. Um, but generally, Everything was amazing, it was a great day, loads of experiences and loads um, of amazing things to see and do. I would definitely recommend coming.